Hey guys, Retro Game Club here, bringing you another tutorial to help you get the most out of your Raspberry Pi. If you're here, you're probably already familiar with Retro Evolved and what it is, but if not, I'll give you a quick rundown. Retro Evolved is software based off RetroPie, which aims to take everything that makes RetroPie great and improve upon that with all of the best themes, customizations for each emulator, shaders, bezels, overclocking, and etc. The goal of Retro Evolved is to be the most powerful video game emulation software made for the Raspberry Pi with the best visual options pre-installed so that you don't have to spend hours configuring, testing, and tweaking all of your settings. So first things first, we're going to go to www.retrogame.club. Once you're on the home page, find the tab that says build your own and hover your mouse over it. Scroll down to Get Retro Evolved and click the link. This will take you to the Retro Evolved download page and it'll automatically start playing our demo video which shows you all of the powerful features of Retro Evolved. Scroll down a little bit, go to step two, which is install Retro Evolved, and here you'll have a download link for Retro Evolved. Click the download link. Enter in your email, your first and last name, and then click send me my download. Verify that you're not a robot. Then you're going to want to open up your email and check the link we just sent you. Check your email and you'll see you've just got an email from the Retro Evolved team that says here's your Retro Evolved download. Click that. In the email, you'll have a direct download link to Retro Evolved. Click this, and it will take you straight to the Google Drive download. Click the download button, choose download anyway, and save it somewhere where you can find it easily. While this is downloading, go ahead and go back to your browser, type in www.etcher.io into the address bar, etcher.io. This is the software we're going to use to burn our image onto our micro SD card so that we can use Retro Evolved on our Raspberry Pi. Download for whatever operating system you're using, whether it be Mac, Linux, or Windows. When you finish downloading Etcher, you can open it and it should look like this. Plug your micro SD to SD adapter into your computer or use your USB adapter. If you do not have one, you can purchase one for a very low cost on Amazon. Once your SD card is plugged into your computer, you can select the middle option in Etcher and choose the SD card that you have plugged into your computer. Then go to the select image location and find the location where you have downloaded Retro Evolved. Select Open, and select Flash. This will install Retro Evolved to your micro SD card. After you've finished, insert your micro SD card into your Retro Evolved console, and power it on. The system will restart one time after it resizes the partition on the micro SD card to take full advantage of the space you have for whatever micro SD card. After you arrive at this screen, simply configure your controller and you're done. After you've finished your controller configuration, you'll arrive at this screen where you can then go to our next tutorial which will explain all of the ins and outs of the Retro Evolved software. Thanks for choosing Retro Evolved.